The Duke of Cambridge addresses coronavirus threat while in Ireland. Prince William was speaking from Ireland. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge are taking advice on the coronavirus threat, but will continue meeting people as usual, it emerged last night. William talked about the infection as he chatted to emergency workers at a reception hosted by Britain's ambassador to Ireland Robin Barnett in the 17th floor gravity bar at Dublin's Guinness Storehouse. He asked Joe Mooney, an advanced paramedic with the National Ambulance Service, I bet everyone's like I've got coronavirus, I'm dying, and you're like no, you've just got a cough. Does it seem quite dramatic about coronavirus at the moment? Is it being a little bit hyped up do you think in the media?" he asked. By the way, the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge are spreading coronavirus. He grimaced in mock horror. Sorry. We're keeping an eye on that, so do tell us if we need to stop. The couple shook hands with dozens of people on the first day of their tour and are expected to continue to do so, based on advice they are being given. A royal source said last night the couple were following guidance from Public Health England and the Department of Health and that meant business as usual for now. This is a discussion we have been having and everything we are doing should continue as usual, said the source. William and Kate enjoyed a pint of Guinness at the historic Dublin brewery of the Irish Stout, with the Duke toasting his hosts in Gaelic, raising his pint and saying slancha. He also addressed the guests from the worlds of sport film, television and the armed forces in Irish, calling them de oye new Azel, ladies and gentlemen. Catherine and I are delighted to be here tonight and are both very grateful to Robin for his generous words, said the Duke. Ireland is a country that we have both heard so much about, so we are really excited to be here with you to see it firsthand for ourselves. In coming to the Guinness Storehouse, we are retracing the footsteps of my grandmother who was shown how to pour the perfect pint here in 2011. Ladies and gentlemen let me tell you it is not often that I find myself following the Queen to a pub. But I am looking forward to testing for myself the theory that Guinness tastes even better in Ireland than overseas. William continued, Thank you for all that you do to support the very special relationship between our two countries. It has been a pleasure to meet so many of you this evening who demonstrate the breadth of our connections across the arts, sports, uniformed services, education and research, and charity sectors. We value it as we do your friendship and are committed to strengthening it further. The Guinness Storehouse tells the story of the famous Irish tipple, from the brewing process to the brand's history in Dublin, and is Ireland's top international visitor attraction welcoming 1.7 million people in 2019. Almost a quarter of visitors to the Irish capital cite the home of Guinness as their main reason for visiting the city. Prince William makes awkward coronavirus joke during royal visit you've just got a cough. Prince William made an awkward joke about the coronavirus outbreak which has seen 51 confirmed cases in the UK during his royal tour in Ireland. Prince William, 37 traveled to Ireland on Tuesday afternoon with Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge in the royal family's first overseas visit since Brexit. But the Duke's awkward joke about coronavirus has sparked backlash online. During his visit to the home of Guinness in Dublin he joked people who believe they have coronavirus just have a cough. Prince William said, I bet everyone's like I've got coronavirus, I'm dying, and you're like no, you've just got a cough. Does it seem quite dramatic about coronavirus at the moment? Is it being a little bit hyped up do you think in the media? By the way, the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge are spreading coronavirus. Sorry. We're keeping an eye on that, so do tell us if we need to stop. Twitter users have since commented hitting out at the second in line to the throne. One said, he takes after his granddad then with the uncomfortable interactions. Another added, this is why Harry will always be more popular than Prince William. A third person wrote, People are literally worried about this virus, nobody knows how anyone can be tested but sure make jokes about some symptoms of the virus like it's nothing. His comments come hours after NHS England declared the deadly COVID-19 a level 4 incident, the highest level of emergency preparedness planning. While Prime Minister Boris Johnson launched the government's plan to combat a potential epidemic of coronavirus in the UK on Tuesday. 
The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge are taking advice on the coronavirus threat but intend to continue meeting people as usual, it emerged last night. The couple shook hands with dozens of people on the first day of their tour and are expected to continue to do so, based on advice they are being given. A royal source said last night the couple were following guidance from Public Health England and the Department of Health and that meant business as usual for now. The source said, this is a discussion we have been having and everything we are doing should continue as usual. William and Kate enjoyed a pint of Guinness at the historic Dublin brewery of the Irish Stout, with the Duke toasting his hosts in Gaelic, raising his pint and saying slancha. He also addressed the guests from the worlds of sport film, television and the armed forces in Irish, calling them de oye in ladies and gentlemen.